Buried in snow for 20 days, a Yuba County mountain road finally drivable tonight. A day after CBS 13 shined a spotlight on the community of neighbors stranded there. County officials say they would have gotten to it eventually, but our reporting sped up the process. Ashley Sharp is getting answers on why a solution took so long in a story you'll see only on CBS 13. Ashley. Well, it comes down to priority. The county has to focus on those main highways and roads with more impact first. And this is a one way winding mountain road. But as we learned, the county actually does not plow these roads for snow. So why then were they clear today? We're getting answers. Roads that trapped a community of Camptonville neighbors for weeks now look like this. Made passable Tuesday morning by county road crews after CBS 13 reported Monday, neighbors had been stuck here for 19 days. Had to build a challenge right now <laughs> during this weather. It's very unusual for us to get the snow last year and this year. Russ Brown, a spokesperson for Yuba County, says these roads, while maintained by the county, are not plowable. We cannot go in and easily plow these roads because if we do, the machinery will tear apart those roads. In fact, these posted signs make that clear. So what is the county responsible for? The answer, keeping the roads safe and passable, which is why crews cleared it as best they could. An unprecedented storm causing unprecedented issues. I mean, it has been 24-7 and these guys are exhausted and they're still out there doing the work. How relieved were you today, uh, you know, to hear from the folks that are there, hey, we can finally get down now? Uh, incredibly relieved. Dana Hawley is one of the few neighbors not snowed in, but snowed out. His farm animals paid the price. The fact that I lost five of my goats that my children have been bottle feeding because I couldn't get in there to take care of them after 20 days is not acceptable. The county says it understands the frustration, but with limited resources, they can't be everywhere at once. And main roads are the focus. We don't, we don't want them to feel like they're different, but we have to prioritize and resources are scarce. I would say myself and my neighbors feel like we were kind of abandoned. Asking now for this not to happen again. Now, the county told me, too, because they are not used to this amount of snow, they're learning from this on how and when to respond.